better to have a short life that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way. Hi. So I've been putting art on the back burner for a while, like I guess a whole month. Haven't been really doing any painting or anything like that. So I think today is the day. I'm going to do a bunch of prep work, I think mostly today and just kind of get ready to start painting tomorrow. It feels really weird not making art for so long because I feel like I associate art with being part of my identity. And when I don't do art, I feel like I'm just losing myself. I think a lot of people during quarantine associated their identity with their job. Whereas like I associate my identity with making art. And when I don't make art, I'm like, who am I? Yeah, this whole month has been kind of just weird. I'm going to be unstretching a painting that I always thought I was going to finish, but turns out I am not going to finish it. So, might as well just reuse the frame. I have to walk Henry and then I'm also going to see Brandon today and probably grab a coffee with him, but I'm hoping to just get back into the swing of things today. So that's kind of like my plans. that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way. I am having trouble stapling one particular part of my frame and it's really annoying. It keeps like turning out like an M and I don't know why. It's not like flat down like that guy is. It's just like an M, but only in that one particular part. I have these other M's. Why? Anyway, so that's annoying. So that's something that I have to somehow figure out. It's not that I'm stapling the old staples either because I like made sure I was not. So I, I don't know why that's happening. Maybe there's like a knot in the wood or something. I have no idea. Anyway, this is taking a lot longer than I anticipated today and I have to get ready and go soon to walk Henry. Okay, so I just got back from walking Henry. I'm uncertain about what to do about my staple guns not going through my canvas, or sorry, not going through my frame. I'm gonna try like hammering some nails in in place of the staple guns. We'll see if that works out. I don't know. Hopefully that works. I just, I don't know what to do if it doesn't work. So let's see. Okay, so the nails didn't work as you've seen, but I found, I guess a solution. I honestly kind of hate my solution, but what I basically did was staple them in sideways. And for some reason that kind of worked. Some of them I had to hammer in still, but you know what? 
for now, it's fine. It's fine. I'm kind of just like over it and I wanna be done stretching my canvas because this has been going on for like way too long. So next, I'm just going to um, put some water and gesso on it and then probably go for coffee with Brandon after that. All right, so let's do that. I have gone with big gaps of no filming, so I really hope that I'm going to be able to put this vlog together in a way that makes sense. Today I'm actually going to get to some painting, which is exciting. Um, it's been a hot minute and I need to get back into it. I feel like earlier in this video I was talking about how I associate art with my identity and you know, when I don't do art, I don't feel my like myself, etc, etc. I think though that like it's not healthy to associate one thing with your identity, whether that's just like work or art or I don't know, whatever it is that you do. I know that people are made of a multitude of things and thoughts and feelings and it's not just about the one thing that you do. So I don't know why I'm like feeling so strange when I don't do art because I'm like, is it really that big of a deal when I have so many other things in my life that make me me? I think I'm getting like a little too deep with this. <laughs> anyway, let's just get to painting. Soon after the sun is up Before the day is over I will be yours Loose laughter softens up tension in my shoulder. Let's take a walk. Let's go. Stay home 
Okay, so it's been a hot minute. Um, I got a new haircut. Uh, I didn't want to film me getting my haircut because I am way too awkward when I film out in public and it's not for me. I want to start again with my painting. I don't know what's been happening lately. Maybe you guys have noticed, I feel like in my last few videos that I've started a painting and then redone it completely. I don't know why, I feel like I've been getting bored halfway through paintings now. So yeah, I kind of wanna, <laughs> not gonna lie, I wanna like do something different. So yeah, I'm kind of thinking of completely obliterating this painting. Sorry if my voice sounds weird, I feel like I'm trying to be quiet and then also I just woke up and this is the first words I've pretty much said all day. Ontario is on lockdown again. I'm just gonna take the time to paint, honestly. I've had like the last four days where I, have, I really haven't done anything because I've just been so exhausted. And it's pretty much dark here all the time in Toronto. This is like the brightest day we've had. So yeah, I just kind of want to take advantage of it and see if I can get some painting done. I feel like so much time has passed since I first started this video. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to you guys at this point because <laughs> I like anticipated on uploading every month. Um, clearly there's been a bit of a gap between that and uh, I apologize. I just really haven't felt inspired and I've felt really busy and overwhelmed and like I don't want to paint and you know I know most artists just push through it and get through whatever but I haven't even wanted to try so anyway I think I'm gonna get to painting now and stop blabbering on and hopefully get somewhere with it today so yeah let's get started take me you know that I'm capable of it You believed in my show And I believed every word you said
Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, I'm struggling a bit with the painting. There's still some sections that you can see my, like, I was gonna call it an underpainting, but the paintings that I did previously on this canvas, because I used so many dark colors, it, it feels like it's making my painting look dark, like the skin look dark. I'm also using like walnut oil and I never use walnut oil. I always use linseed oil and walnut oil is just like, it dries faster than linseed oil does. And I feel like it's making my paint like tacky. So yeah, I'm not a huge fan of that. Yeah, I'm just kind of like not really enjoying the process right now. Hopefully that changes soon because like it's painful. I also kind of wanted to like start thinking about, I don't know, like another way to say what I'm, I want to say here is just, I want to start thinking about painting as like a conversation between like myself and paint. That sounds so pretentious. Sorry. Right now this painting is so straightforward in a way and I want it to be more exciting with paint. Like, you know, pushing and pulling things and stuff like that. But I think that's gonna end up happening a little further down the road once I feel more comfortable with what I've actually like put down. Cause right now I don't feel good about how it's looking. So, you know, we'll see, I guess, what happens with all of that. Anyway, I just wanted to like check in with you guys. Anyway, I just wanted to like talk about why things weren't going good. So I'm gonna get back to it and hopefully things will start going better for me. And told me that's what you needed That's in my face Yeah Cause you were coward and that was easy Watching, waiting Watching, waiting problems Watching, waiting Watching, waiting on your breath but in my head I still think you mean it thoughts left unsaid no. fading fast common sense depleted oh no Okay, so I actually think I'm done, oddly enough. I kind of like the painting, like, wiped out. I was going to do more, and then I, like, thought about it overnight, and then I was like, no, I think it's cool. <laughs> I know that maybe some of you probably liked the way that it looked before, but I think it looks better now. And it's kind of more, I guess, like, what I was thinking of going for anyway. I think there's still a possibility that this painting could go through more changes, but I think it's one of those things that I would have to sit on for like a few months. And I do think that this like video should go out, well, it should have gone out a while ago, but I think that this is the most changes it's going to go through for now at least. And with that, that is gonna be the end of this video. If you like this video, then give it a like. If you wanna subscribe, then subscribe, and I will see you all in the next one. All right, bye.